in a fascination twist reminiscent of a Hollywood thriller. A recent report from Nova Scotia's Information and Privacy Commissioner shed light on a bizarre incident that unfolded during the filming of Titanic in August 1996. The report urges Halifax Regional Police HRP, to unveil more details regarding an episode where approximately 80 crew members, including re-owned director James Cameron, were hospitalized after unwittingly consuming lobster chowder spiked with hallucinogenic drug phencyclidine, commonly known as PCP or angel dust. Initially mistaken for food poisoning, the crew's night took a surreal turn as the effect of the drug set in, leading to scenes of laughter, tears and vomit among the affected individuals. Actor Bill Paxton reflecting on the chaos vividly described a night of vividly phenomenon which even saw the formation of a hospital conga line. The Commissioner's report comes as a response to a Freedom of Information request complaint, challenging the heavy reductant nature of the initial released police record. Nova Scotia's Information and Privacy Commissioner, Tricia Ralph, emphasized that while personal identifying information could be withheld, factual observation made by witnesses should be disclosed unless they contain identifiable personal information. If Halifax Police adhere to RAF's recommendation, the nearly three-decade-old records detailing HRP's investigation into the incident could be unveiled by the mid-May. However, the identity of the perpetrator remains elusive, with the case reportedly closed in February 1999 without any suspect named. The Titanic crew, stationed in Atlantic Canada for filming purposes, found themselves embroiled in this unexpected ordeal during the production of the movie's modern-day scenes which notably did not feature lead actors Kate Winslet and Leonardo DiCaprio. Despite the harrowing experience, all crew members eventually recovered. Set decorator Claude Russell reminisced about the incident in 2022 interview, fondly recalling actor Bill Paxton's amiable demeanor amidst the chaos. Paxton's presence brought a sense of levity to the situation, with the witnesses recounting surreal scenes of grip manuring wheelchairs down the hospital hallways. As the curtain lifts on this decade-old mystery, the public eagerly waits the unmasking of the preparator behind this peculiar chapter in cinematic history.